Hello everyone, happy Wednesday. Tasha here. We have a box opening. So I'm not gonna get into too much detail. The baby was overnighted on Monday and the USPS kind of dropped the ball and oh, it's been quite a stressful few days. Thank God. Uh, my baby has arrived. All right. What I am going to do is because I know that I tend to be, um, a bit lengthy in my box openings and I do very much so, you know, want to enjoy this box opening. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just adjusting you. I like ran in from the post office, <laughs> got my son set up and here I am. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the box opening. Um, and then um, following the box opening, I'm going to do a details video of the baby and um, a more elaborate chat of um, <clears throat> the journey I had with this um, baby and um, the artist of this baby um, because it has been um, quite uh, remarkable, quite magical, just, you know, just has. Um, so I really want to share that, but if I share all of that during the box opening, we're going to be, you know, like forever here. Um, I hope, hey, I'm sorry guys, I don't want to start this over, so I'm just trying to make sure we're somewhat even here so you're not looking at a cockeyed video. So we're going to begin, um, the box opening and, uh... As usual, my video quality is poor <laughs> and we're blurring in and out, but we'll get you back here in a, in a second, I'm sure. Usually if I move something, there we go. All right. So, um, this baby is, as many of you may know, is my first ethnic baby. And this baby has come from Kimberly at Kimberly's Cocoon. Hi, Kimberly. We're finally here. <laughs> so, um, no wait. And this box is like so huge, <laughs> so heavy. What's in here? I'm going to find out. And um, Kimberly always posts the box packing of her babies. Um, which will go up immediately once she knows my box opening is up. So um, uh, if I can edit, which I'm sure I can add in the description of my video, I will link, you know, her her uh, video. And I will certainly, um, right away, I will link Kimberly's channel in my description. Um, if you do not follow Kimberly at Kimberly's Cocoon, um, I, you, I recommend you should head on over there. Um, she's, her channel is just a lot of fun. She's just, just a, such a warm, great person. And her babies are just stunning and unique and just, you know, really, you know, check, check out her channel for sure. <laughs> All right. Um, so this is what the box, and I know her babies, um, usually there's a tablecloth in there cause I've seen not my baby, but other babies box packing and this is a Christmas um, uh, tablecloth um, that is here we go oh wow I mean this box is packed oh, to the max look at this guys and it's heavy I think it's the post office is 13 pounds um, and I know my baby is not nowhere near that heavy <laughs> there's a lot in here so Oh, one of Kimberly's um, signature uh, tote bags. Oh, this, oh, cute. The hand sanitizer is attached to the, how sweet. Oh, I can't, I want to check out this bag. How beautiful. Oh, so this is a tote bag. It's um, Kimberly's Cocoon. It says www.kimberlyscocoon.com. It has a beautiful um, butterfly on it um, with blue and brown. It says, congratulations on the adoption of your baby from, sorry, that's what it says on the top, and then the butterfly and Kimberly's 
uh, cocoon beautiful how sweet is that thank you Kimberly and there is a hand sanitizer actually attached to it cucumber melon very nice Aww. yeah I've seen these bags and other box packings but they're so beautiful in, in person really you know when you see things in person it's you know yeah just really nice okay so this is the baby's um paperwork um kimberly's cocoon hand made from my heart to yours adoption papers um so i'm going to put these aside and we are going to um look at these uh later there's some uh pictures inside and the adoption papers and whatever I'll, you know i'll be looking at this uh later all right and oh my goodness <gasps> look at these diapers <gasps> oh kimberly i love this with the elephants oh how cute and another one has a, a flamingo and i think that's a cheetah and zebra oh just so beautiful oh and another one has froggies <gasps> Oh, and another one is green. It has little, um, little babies with like a buggy bug kind of head with little anthro, um, antennas. I think that looks like oh, so cute. I bet these are honest diapers. These these uh, first three. And you know what? I I have I have none. I've never seen one. I I've always admired everyone else's, and these are just beautiful. Thank you, Kimberly. Yes, I get excited about diapers. I get excited about everything. So, <laughs> I can't believe that this is just finally happening. So, we're opening the first package, and it is in a beautiful, um, I'm not good with the colors. This is like a, a oh, teal, teal blue, and it has a white ribbon um, with little um, blue baby feet on it. So, I, well, let me open the the package. <laughs> the, oh, look at this. I saw this in the photo shoot. So this is a, a little overall set. Oh, goodness, look at how cute. I didn't see this shirt. Kimberly told me that it had come with a different shirt than what was in the photo shoot. And it's a little overall set. Um, It's just so adorable. It's little denim overalls. It also has a pocket in the front with um, blue and white stripes. Oh, look at the back, how cute. Oh my goodness. And then this it, shirt, um, it's a little uh, actually button down um, onesie, but it's uh, a collared shirt and it's got beautiful uh, lime green. And then it's like a, a plaid with blues and reds. It has, um, kind of almost paint splats with um uh mickey mouse uh on it uh it's it's very hip and cool and so him so obviously everyone you see that it's a boy which of course you know i knew you were gonna know that when i started with the uh with the box opening so it's a boy <laughs> and there is oh such a story behind that and um that is my um because i didn't know as kimberly was creating this baby um in fact i really thought kimberly was very much leaning towards girl and i saw a lot of girl in the kit um and i kind of secretly was like the cherry on top would be if that baby turned around last minute to a boy because my heart is just so much with little boys. I mean, I have three daughters. I would not trade them for the world. And obviously, I have little girl reborns that I love so much. And I want them. And, I, you know, I love little girls and dressing them and stuff. But my heart is, like, for a special baby is with a boy. So it just was um, a big, as Kimberly would say, joy bubble. <laughs> That this baby turned out at the last minute to say I'm a boy <laughs> so oh my goodness like okay so let's get to some stuff on the side so this is a pretty um 
darker green again i'm bad with colors tissue paper with like a teal blue um ribbon on it everything's so beautiful and so pretty oh my goodness so here's his little shirt that was in the photo shoot and it's a little um button down um shirt uh collared shirt with pinstripes and it's tan and it has some um, browns and greens and it has this adorable little what do you call these hats um, are they messenger hats I, I'm not sure you see this little hat anyway these are um, this is his wardrobe from his um, photo shoot which you can also go on um, Kimberly's um, uh, YouTube and I, I mean she did just such an amazing job on the photo shoot and all of her babies. If you look and see, look the, uh, look at that kit, you'll know his, his kit when we're done. And look at the photo shoots. Wow, she took some beautiful photos and she dresses her babies just so beautifully and neatly. So, something to check out. Okay, this was uh, in tissue paper and a seafoam green with a baby blue bow. And this is his little monkey, uh, not monkey, uh, pirate pajamas. Oh gosh, they look so cute. I love these pajamas. And they're so soft. Um, so there are two piece um, pajamas, uh, long sleeve shirt and pants. And they, I believe they have like a cream color and then they have um, pirates on them and pirate ship in like a navy blue. Um, I should be holding stuff up closer, but that's the print. Um, just so, so, so cute. So adorable and very unique. Um, very unique. So we're piling all this. I have the uh, babies lined up back there, but they're just there for to to watch on to watch their baby brother get opened. So I'm just randomly picking out here. I see. Oh, oh, cute little shoes. Oh my goodness! And I I pulled out a candy cane at the same time. I was grabbing a shoe. <laughs> um, and these are little gray. How do I even describe these? They are, um, let's see, they're made by Koala Baby, and they're kind of like a dress shoe, but in like a, that's not velvety, uh, felty. It's almost like a felty um, material. I, I'm so bad at describing things, but these, these are adorable. So adorable. Oh my goodness, I can't, everything's so, so adorable. I, I can't, oh gosh, and I got, I just got done with my son's parent-teacher conference, so I did not plan to have makeup. I had everything set up yesterday for the, the, the uh, box opening, and I was just, um, you know, I just had sweats and a, a t-shirt. It was warm yesterday, it's freezing today. I had no makeup on because I'm like, I'm gonna cry, I know I'm gonna cry, so now I have I have makeup all over my face because, of course, I just got done with my son's parent-teacher conference, which I wasn't going to with no makeup. So, I'm going to pull a package from by the top of his head or the bottom of his head, whichever that is. And this is in a red tissue paper um, with a big blue ribbon. And... Oh, you sent this too, Kimberly. Oh, that's what the little shoes go with. Thank you so Oh my gosh. This is another outfit. Another overall outfit. I love this. This is the one in the pictures where he's throwing the snowballs, which is so cute. These are, oh, this is, oh, look at the, the one piece. Um, onesie is red. It says Daddy's Rock Star on the front. It goes underneath these, these overalls. And it has, um, on the sleeves, it has gray and white stripes. So soft, too. This is a Carter's. Um, and then the little overalls is my oh, baby gap. And, um, they are, uh, like a dark charcoal gray, and then they have, um, a much lighter gray, like, pinstripe down them. 
Um, they have like one big pocket on the front. They have two little buttons on the side. And oh my goodness, they have little pockets in the back. Working pockets. Oh, he can stick things in his pockets because he's such a boy. Oh, we're blurring out. And uh, the pockets have little buttons that actually, working buttons. <laughs> he's so, little boy. <laughs> this is just. It's so surreal right now. Oh my gosh. I... Nope. Can't. <laughs> can't. 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 Keep moving here. Okay. Like I said, I'm just grabbing things out of the side. There's some more candy canes, which Gabe will probably come in and join me on the second video and enjoy these um, candy canes for sure. Um, and this is orange tissue paper uh, with a beautiful green bow. And oh, meanwhile, I'm piling everything all together, but I will sort through that later. And, <laughs> this is his little outfit. This was his uh, debut outfit on uh, Kimberly's uh, channel. <laughs> So it's a it's a very dark blue uh, almost a black but the, but it's dark blue um, and uh, it's a top and bottom and the top has a little tie on it um, in plaid uh, I think that's plaid uh, and it has uh, light gray and dark gray and some blue and then it has like the knee patches on it uh, on the pants um, that match the the tie so that He's just so, so cute, so cute. And this is, uh, baby, you're uh, gorgeous. Wow, I wonder where that came from. That's very, I've never heard of that. That is adorable. Adorable. Oh, goodness. Ah, okay, so what's poking up here right up front? is wow all right so this is a little um i forget what you call these little sacks oh oh kimberly thank you so much oh god i can't with the makeup i can't yet until i see him without my mascara running down my face oh kimberly thank you so you didn't have to do that guys this is uh Jetty's Blend um, Oil. It's a huge bottle of it, too. Kimberly. Oh, thank you. Uh, I will have to, in my following video, um, this is Jetty's Blend Oil, and um, we had looked... Uh, um, I'll, I'll get into the story. I know the meaning of it, and I'm going to get into it. It's a gift from, from Kimberly. Um, and in the second video, we're going to do a details video and we're going to look at all the stuff again. And then I'm going to talk about, um, this as it fits into our, our journey. Um, because I like, I want to make the, bo I don't want the box opening to be like an hour and a half long where, where people, you know, can't, can't make it. So we'll talk about that in, um, thank you, Kimberly. <sighs> I am really trying to so hard to stay composed here. Because if uh, I'm going to have to, like, stop the video to wash the makeup off my face if my mascara starts really going. It might happen. Oh, wow. Very nice. And this is um, soap. And it's coming out of the mascara, so hang on. Zumbar goat's milk soap. Tangerine orange. Oh. Oh, that smells really good. Wow, thank you, Kimberly. Oh my gosh, I am going to enjoy this so much. And I'm sure she's going to tell me about what it's going to do for me. If not, just to make me smell pretty and my skin nice. <laughs> Which is good. <laughs> thank you very much, Kimberly. I, I just... <sighs> I, I'm sorry. I, I got to grab a tissue so the makeup doesn't go.
I'm sorry, guys. This is so ridiculous. I'm so sorry. Oh. Oh. I, sh I, I know I can stop this and and clip it together, but I, you know, it's it's real, so you know. Okay, I'm just gonna stick this stuff on my dresser so that it's not rolling around with the baby stuff. Okay. <sighs> All right. All right. Let's just. I see. Oh, there's little like um things in here. Like this is a little tiny blue pacifier. Like those little party fever things. Just you know, decorative stuff. So let me. Oh my gosh, there's more stuff down in camera. <laughs> okay, so there's a bunch more candy canes. There's a little something on the side that I. I see that I'm going to leave in the box till I open him. So we have candy canes and of course so nice and appropriate for Christmas. I think that's all the candy canes. So let me put these on my dresser as well so they don't get broken. All right. And we have a bottle down here. Oh my goodness, how cute. A nook bottle. It's blue. It has a little ducky tied to it. And it has candy inside. Oh, thank you so much, Kim, for me. That's so nice. And I don't have any kind of bottles like this. This is so cute. Oh, I love it. Love, love. Oh, and look, it has a little constellation. Is that constellation on it? Stars? Very pretty um, designs. I'll look at all, all details after. I, if, if I'm missing any detail, I'm like so, again, the last two days were, uh, you'll hear all about that. So it's just like, I, it's so like surreal now that, that he's here and you have no idea how special this baby is to me. You will all soon hear. So, um, this is another package, and this is um, an orange with a very pretty uh, maroon um, uh, ribbon. And this is wrapped in a diaper. Oh, a joy bubble. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, it's one of her joy bubbles. So it's just like a clear um, round, like ornament. Um, this has a baby blue ribbon on it. And it says joy on each side. Oh, beautiful. Thank you so much. Oh, I know where this is gonna hang. It's gonna hang over the babies. All right, so guys, I just wanna stick this also on my dresser. Oh, let me not block my tissues. <sighs> All right, let me get up on in here and make sure I'm not missing anything. I don't think I missed anything. Oh, wait, no, I did. <laughs> I know there's one more thing in there, Kimberly. I see, you know, you know what that is too. Um, I, I want to leave that in there for probably my life. Um, and this is a Frosty the Snowman book. Um, it's one of the those uh, chunky board books. <laughs> so cute. Oh, and it's so cold today. What a perfect day to read this book to them. All right. Okay. So, oh my gosh, more candy canes. And, uh, oh, how cute. Okay. So, guys, okay, we have a little knock at the door. Yes, Gabe? Can I have a fruit snack? Yes, you may have a fruit snack. 
<laughs> He's going to come in in the, in the uh, second video. All right. So we have a little, another little, uh, I call these sachet bags. I, I really have no idea what they're called. But um, this has his little honey bug um, passy, his little honey bug blue passy. And how adorable. It has two little uh, turtles. One is a little uh, aquatic or semi-aquatic turtle. And one is a little land turtle. And how perfect to go in those little uh, overall pockets. <laughs> because that's so him. <laughs> so, there is one thing and I will... I'm sure myself can block you guys. I'm just going to put that up to the side for a minute. And we are going to have a lift off of the baby. He's, he's so heavy. He's only supposed to be five pounds. And, oh, I see something. Oh, for Keith. All right. And there's also something else in the bottom here underneath. So, let's get him. I, Kimberly, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to leave this in the box for Gabriel. Um, guys, Kimberly sent something in here for my son. I don't know if you guys can see because, well, I'll pick it up. Ooh, it's heavy. Um, but here it is. Um, and I'm gonna, I wanna leave this in here because, and then there's all these little um, like trinket things and there's another candy cane in there. I'm gonna just put this to the side and I'm gonna leave because I'm gonna call him in and I'm gonna, sorry, tell him that there's something that, cause he knows I was waiting for this delivery, he thought it was coming yesterday and all that. So I'm gonna tell him, you know, that there's something special that's left in the box by him. So we're gonna do that in a little bit. So I'm gonna put that to the side for now and not look at that. And there's one last thing in the bottom in purple tissue paper with blue ribbon. Nate, am I supposed to look at this after him because it was under? No, it's probably just packed because she had to pack this down hard. Oh my goodness. It's John Lennon. Oh my goodness. Oh, Kimberly. Oh my God. Oh, did you make this stuff? Oh my gosh. All right, guys. So if any of you have watched my videos, you know that I've been collecting the John Lennon um, pieces, some things for um, the babies. Um, one. <laughs> um, so this is a burp cloth and it's definitely handmade and this has the John Lennon um, print on it um, and this is uh, a little um, bib it's like in the shape of a bandana it has uh, um, it has velcro on it and it's the John Lennon, and this is authentic, it, copyright 2001. Kimberly, I don't know where you got this. And this, what it, I can't believe that you, thank you so much. I will treasure this. I just, I've got to get a sip of water. I got to propose myself, guys. I got to, I, I told myself I have to, I have to at least get to, get to the, the baby so I can see him without my mascara, you know, blinding me. I'm seeing the inside. I didn't realize the outside, the music print. Oh my gosh. 
Kimberly, oh my, I, I can't believe you did all this. Oh my. Oh, oh this is beautiful. Oh, wow, this is gorgeous. Oh, guys, can you see this? I mean, you're going to see it good afterwards. But on the one side, it has um, the... Um, the notes, um, you know, which that, you know, you see it with the set, the sheets and all, and all that. And the other side has the print, um, which is, uh, again, it's the John Lennon print. It has just the, his whimsical drawings of animals and very beautiful color. I, if you guys can feel this quilt, it's so soft and thick and warm and Oh, he, he was so warm. I was thinking today, oh, it's so freezing and he's out there, but no, he was so warm. Oh, Kimberly, this is too much. I, I'm like, I'm so, wow. And I haven't even looked at the baby yet. Thank you. I know this is his belly plate, so this is also something I'm just going to put to the side to um, get afterwards, and we are very close here, so, and okay, this is his feet, okay. He has uh, her little tie around him um, that has the, the wooden butterfly um, that says, um, Handmade with love. Um, I see that his name is written on the other side. It has a little rattle and um, it's in a bow that says it's a boy. Thank you, Kimberly. And I'm going to put that to the side. And he is in a little blanket. Uh, I don't know how, I never, I always forget how you say this. Uh, muscle, mausoleum. Some people call them muslin blankets, but I think it's like supposed to be like anyway it's a monkey it has monkeys on it and I am sorry guys I'm not doing the whole breach thing I've done a bunch of those I certainly know I'm happy with the way the baby looks so um I am getting that's it he's here <laughs> Boy, I better stop if you guys <laughs> weren't looking at the picture on this video and you hear me. Oh, mommy's gonna fix your hair. <gasps> oh, baby boy. Oh my goodness, we feel this. <gasps> oh, Kimberly. I he's got his little monkey. <gasps> I didn't see this outfit. This is a surprise for mommy. Oh, thank you. Oh. <laughs> He's so beautiful. <sighs> oh, everyone, please welcome Asir. I chose an African name for him. Um, his name uh, means one with a um, uh, captivating and fascinating personality. And he's like, you one little shoe's falling off. Let's take your shoes off. These adorable little shoes from his photo shoot. Let me get up here with him, guys, so we can see him. I can't. I believe he's here. How beautiful he is. I need my tissue. Oh, oh baby, I need my tissue. Oh. Oh, gosh, it's not coming. Okay. Oh, guys. Oh, look at this baby. Look at this baby. Oh, my God. Little ears. Oh, and I forgot. I 
forgot. Hold on. Let me put them on. Pat something. And I will tell the story about it. Oh, look at the this person. Oh, my eyes are burning. I knew this was going to happen. All right, I'm trying. Oh. Sierra wears glasses. <laughs> Can you all see them? And they are like little John Lennon glasses. And Kimberly had um, these glasses in mind for this kit all along. Oh my gosh, his hair is so beautiful. Do you all know what kit this is? Does anybody have a guess? Would you like to put it in the comments? No. We're gonna, we'll do a little. Let, let me at least show you his feet so maybe people could possibly see. Um, because, you know, there's a few things about him that, oh, look at him. <gasps> Maybe more hair. Oh, you twitchies are cold. It's okay because you're gonna warm up with your mommy. Oh, he feels so good. So his little feet. Let's look at his little feet. You see those little feet? Look at those little toes. He has these like splayed out toes. This baby. The personality on this baby. I mean... <laughs> This is the Sally kit by Bonnie Brown. Um, I believe it was 2013. Did I get that right, Kimberly? It's a Bonnie Brown kit. Um, it's a Sally kit. And just, oh, look at this. Oh, my gosh. Oh, so there is a huge, long story that Asira and I'm gonna really, as Asir and I are gonna tell. I, I really, in my um, pronunciation, it's Asir, Asir. Um, you're really supposed to roll the R and it sounds, you know, because it is an authentic African name, um, which I, it was very important for me um, that he has um, uh, an African na name, so I've learned, um, always have like it, their name for meanings and him is have, uh, you know, one with a, um, captivating and fascinating personality. Um, you know, a lot of them are like, you know, uh, second born child or born on a Wednesday or, you know, um, uh, second twin, you know, just me, you know, the, the names have meanings and some are like, you know, mean, you know, God, God's law, you know, whatever, just meanings. And so of course I had to find something that fit like, you know, a big person, you know, that this fit his personality. So I was looking up all the pronunciations and it is spelled A-A-S-I-R. Um, and so I'm saying it Asir. It's Asir, but you're supposed to roll the R and make it sound, but I don't have an African accent, um, so, <laughs> nor do I pick up other languages and that sort of stuff really well. I actually pick up accents really good if I'm speaking to someone, like if I'm speaking to my friends down south, like before the conversation's over, like I have a southern accent. It's, it's ridiculous, um, but because I've not recently spoken to someone from Africa to pick up on the whole, not just hear the name pronounced, but to, you know, hear the whole, you know, anyway, uh, Asir and I will, uh, practice his name because I just adore his name and, uh, he's here so he can teach me a bit. This baby boy that just, yeah, gosh, he is. I love him so much. I can't wait to just spend some time with him and put just this feet. His hair, Kimberly, is so soft. I, 
you know, soft doesn't even describe. It's, I've never felt mole hair like this. I've never felt hair, maybe I felt hair like this on a real baby. Yeah, I felt hair like this on an actual baby. <laughs> That's the only time I felt hair like this. Wow. And he's got his little um, cross that all Kimberly's babies have. I have um, rosary beads uh, from Medjugorje that uh, many, many years ago, I was like 14 years old, um, that I made out of this wood. And we were supposedly blessed in Medjugorje. Oh, look at this painting. It's just gorgeous. See, I've never seen one of Kimberly's babies in person. But just wow. Over and I am just, I'm so in love. Thank you, baby. My pretty baby. So pretty. All right, so I'm going to give you guys another look. Asir and I will be back on in a little while. I'm going to go compose myself. I'm going to get his uh, things together. And, um, then I'll come back on and we'll have Gabe come in and uh, look at his gift because I don't want to open that without him in here. And I, I, he, we just got back and he's, I know he's content on his game. If I pull him off, he won't be interested in looking at anything. So <laughs> we'll wait until he's ready and then we will, uh, we'll do that. And um, Kimberly, I, uh, um, thank you is just not, um, there's just no words to thank you. Um, there's no, oh, he's yelling at his game. I hear him in there. It's a good time for us here and I to go check it out. Just in the, the John Lennon, the quilt and the, the bib and the birth, birth cloth. I, I just... You are so kind and generous and so thoughtful. And the jetties, I, I, I'm just like, well, like I said, guys, I'm going to come back on. I'm going to talk about Kimberly and our journey with this, um, this Sally sculpt, Sally to Asir. And, um, of course I'm not going to share any personal, you know, uh, details, but, uh, private details, I, I should say, um, you know, of our conversations or anything of that nature, but, you know, just in, you know, just in general, the whole journey, I'm just, I, I'm so happy, I'm <laughs> so, happy, and now I can shut the camera off and blow my eyes out, <laughs> happy, of course, it's ridiculous. I'm so happy. It's still blurring in and out. Come on, buddy. Wave to everybody. All right. Thank you for watching, everyone. I know it was long. I know. Um, just <laughs> cuckoo me. I, I know. I get it. I know. I hope everyone enjoyed uh, welcoming Asir, and I hope you all think he's as adorable as I do. I, I mean, God, I, he, yeah, he can't even, look at that. <laughs> the personality on this baby, he's such a peanut with such a huge personality, and I just love it, love it, love it, love it. So I can't wait to mush him and cuddle him. We'll be back. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you, Kimberly. God bless everyone.